All right, welcome back to the Central Valley Buzz, everybody. I'm your host, Chuck Leonard. Our next guest has been here before. If you've been watching the show for a while, there is no way that you will have forgotten him. Let's bring in Percy Maximus. Thank you so much, Perseus. Perseus, Chuck, every time. Perseus. But you know what? I like how you're kind of casual with me now. It's like, hey, it's Percy. Hey, Percy, good to see you, you know? So I kind of like the way you're saying that to me. But yes. Yes, I am back. I am back on Central Valley Buzz. And let me tell you, things have taken off kind of for me since the last time I've been on. Are you back in the porn industry? No, no, no. Well, I haven't. I wish. I haven't made it that big back into the business. But, you know, ever since I've been on and people kind of got maximized with some of my moves last time, that it's made it a little easier for them to say yes or no to me. Because instead of being able to lie about what I do on stage, uh, they know me from your show now, and it's usually a straight up yes or no at this point. Now, I haven't gotten any yeses, but I think it's really helped some of the promoters in town and club owners see what I'm about as a result of being on your show last time. Oh, right? Are you all right? No, that's, you know what? I've been doing it for so many years, I don't even know I'm doing it anymore. What you know? do you think you're I just, doing? I don't even know. You know, I feel it. You just, you know what? When I was down with Jimmy Tutu in 1984, back on the strip, okay? I know I, I won't go over the whole story with you. He taught me, he said, boy, never let him catch you dancing. Just always let him catch you living. And that's what I've been doing. I'm just living. And you think I'm dancing? That's just me. I, I'm a force to be reckoned with. That's why you always get maximized, Mr. Leonard. Fill, fill, fill my heart. Fill my heart how quick it's beating. <laughs> Fill my heart how quick. Oh my God, you just, you're getting maximized. I don't even know. Sanitizer? I don't even know how you just didn't turn to gold right there. So, yes, yeah, so, and Chuck, you know what? I think next time I come on, we should do a little dance tutorial. I think I should be able to teach you some of the moves that got me caught. Yeah, you know what it is? It's all the years of wearing the body oils on stage that I just naturally secrete my own body oils, if you will. So, you're, you know, you don't want to wipe that off. You're going to want a lotion with that. Because if you take what I have and you bottle it up, and I'm working on that, by the way. It's going to be called Maximization. I'm hoping to get it in all the local stores here soon. But it's going to be my natural body oils to help you moisturize your skin. So you're going to bottle up your own body oils yes. and try to sell them? Yes, and you know what? I think if I can get on to dance anywhere, uh, and you know, local club owners, uh, Perseus is here. Uh, but if I can get some of them to call me, maybe I can sell it at some of the shows as well, you know, that I get booked on. Right now, yours is all I'm working with. And then, <laughs> I'm, and I'm that, sure that that's the case. And that yes. Crystal Bowl show on Friday nights, 8 p.m. That's all I got right about now. So, uh, what, what kind of things are you looking to do, Percy? Well, like I said, I, I am kind of an out-of-work Mel, uh, exotic dancer. I can do uh, other types of dance. I'm learning some clog dancing. Um, I'm hoping it's going to help me get some you more jobs. You wore your clogs today, didn't yes, you? Yes, I did. I'm hoping it's going to give me some extra jobs around town. And, you know, I'm trying to also break the myth while I'm out there that, you know, a lot of um, a lot of Mel strippers aren't as manly as, as the, a lot of people say they are. That's a little stigma that got started. People say that? Yeah, in the late 80s, early yeah. 90s, and I just want to let you know that that's not true, because I love the ladies. I love to kiss them. I love to kiss them on their, uh, on their, I love to hold their hands, and I love to, well, to like, hug them. You, you were going to kiss them on their, on their, uh, cheeks, I guess, or yeah, where, do you, yeah. where do you guys and kiss then, them yeah, at? You love to hold their hands. Them, hold their hands, and, uh, you know, uh, I like booties. So, I mean, as you can tell, I'm a ladies man. I mean, just listen to me, look at me. So, I mean, <laughs> So, I mean, yeah, so I want to break that stereotype as well about male strippers, because we are manly, you know? We are manly. Oh, couple of Yeah, <laughs> sorry. Yeah. It's, I don't even know I'm doing it. It just happens. I'm just so, saying. are you looking to maybe do some private parties? I do private parties. I do birthday parties. I do children's parties. I can clean this act up. I got children's friendly dances and puppets and stuff like that. I also, uh, I also do corporate functions. Corporate parties, uh, I don't know if uh, Central Valley Buzz is looking for their next little get together, if they'd like to get maximized. Uh, that, that's how Not getting, so much. Well, that's, that's, <laughs> and getting maximized is really a preference in 2014. Some want to get maximized, some don't. It's kind of like saying, do you want to breathe or not breathe today? That's how I looked at getting maximized, you know? I guess the only natural question at this point is would be like, uh, how's your childhood? Oh, <laughs> you can you okay, okay. Imagine this, a little a little twelve year old little twelve year old 
fit Percy. Percy is Maximus running around the front yard, had his dad's coat on, you know, no shirt on under so he can show that maximization. Running around and dancing in the yards, all the little kids are playing their games. And you know, Perseus is just going and they're like, hey Perseus, wanna play some soccer? And I said, yeah, if you wanna be a loser. And I'm just still going, you know? And I did that all the way up until my 20s, until I started getting paid for it, Mr. Leonard. How old is Percy Maximus? Oh, you know, listen, Percy is, is, is ageless. I'm like Santa Claus, you know? I will never age. I am timeless. And much when my, my time has come to get off the stage, which, by the way, I'm nowhere near right now. No one worry, okay? The minute that day comes, I will, it's my Batman. I'll hand, off the, I'll hand off the glasses, and I'll teach him how to grow the mustache, and I'll hand off the coat. And to a new Perseus Maximus. But that is far from happening. You don't have to worry about that, Chucky. Well, uh, <laughs> speaking of Batman, we wanted to close the show on, an, on a nice note. Okay. Now, you know, did you see the Bat Kid? Yes, that was sweet. Talk about bringing a tear to old Perseus Maximus' eyes, huh? Well, the Bat Kid had his day in San Francisco. Yes. And all of San Francisco was totally into it. But... At the end of the day, mm -hmm. that cost money. Yes. And it came out to $105,000. Okay, okay. Well, there's been a couple in the Bay Area that has stood up and said, you know what, city of San Francisco, we are not going to let you pay that $105,000. We are paying it for you. Oh, my goodness. Isn't that awesome? Oh, my goodness. So there are some great people in this world. Oh, my and goodness. I think, I think that's just a, a great gesture for a great thing. Do we have names of those people? I think they want to be, go uh, anonymous. I wonder right if now. they're looking they're to... They're philanthropists and they don't want their name out there. I wonder if they're looking to any fun, like any local strippers that are looking to get back on their feet, you know, because... I don't think so. That's it's charity at its finest, Mr. Leonard. It's charity at its finest when you help out Perseus. You get maximized. Okay, Perseus Maximus, everybody. Happy Martin All Luther King right. Day, everyone. All right, we're gonna take a uh, we're gonna take off is what we're gonna do. Oh, uh, the show is over. I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me the last two hours with the best of the best things in Fresno, including Perseus Maximus. Woo! Okay, we're gonna take off, but we will be back tomorrow at 11 a.m. to bring you the Central Valley Buzz. I'm Chuck Leonard, and we're out of here. Mm -hmm.